Your gear is tired. Waiters need patching, reels need repairing, and the garage needs cleaning. And you're tired. Staying in and catching up on a season's worth of lost sleep sounds wonderful. But it's not time for that yet. Most of the big fish left with a nor'easter more than a month ago. But the old timers have told you that the biggest fish come through late, after the majority of fishermen have stopped fishing. So you keep going. Your fishing buddies have hung up their jetty cleats, and the only fresh intel is your own. But that's for the best. This late in the season, the stripers move so fast that if you chase reports, you'll rarely catch up to the fish. Mm -hmm. I began the free. I began the free. Knows I'm gonna stay, gonna stay this day. Go to the church. Please. Cast after unanswered cast, you daydream about big fish and warm weather and wonder if you fully appreciated them when it was happening. Wonder where the big fish you caught in July is right now. Off New Jersey, Virginia, or maybe it's still here, fat as a pig and looking for one last meal before swimming south. Take one more, fish just blew up on it. I think, I think. It might not have been anything, but it might have been a fish. Even the schoolies got scarce once the cold set in. You saw the last of them on a 15 degree morning more than a week ago. Since then, the fishless trips have been mounting. But you'll keep casting until you're absolutely sure the last bass is left. And even then, you might go one last time. <laughs>